Happy Hump Day, everyone. I am Drake the Nitwits. Thanks for stopping by and checking out my channel. So, I have somehow managed to completely jack up my sleeping. I am definitely don't have a problem with insomnia right now. I have a problem with sleeping so much. I'm going to bed at my normal time. And I'm sleeping till like 10, 30, 11. I'm not taking the sleeping pill. This is frustrating. Because um, I woke up. Like, I went to bed at, I mean, lights out at 11. I was probably asleep by, by midnight. That's normal for me. I woke up at 11, 11.30, and was up for maybe half an hour, and took a nap, and slept until, like, 3 or 3.30, and then got up. Of course, now I'm wide awake. Um, so, this goes on my list of things to talk to my doctor about. Um, I did finish the Latchuk rug. Yay. I want to get a rod that I can, you know, fix along the back so that it doesn't gape when I'm hanging down like the other one is. And then I will hang it up or find a frame for it. I'm not sure which. And I went ahead and got all my patches ironed on that I've been collecting. This Some of these came from when David and Chuck went to Disney World. Like that one and the Gryffindor one. Um, and that one... Maleficent, The Queen, Poor Unfortunate Souls, and Republic Navy Rescue. The rest of these are like eBay ones, like this one. This one's kind of neat. It's got the, the mermaid scales. So, that. I've got my other little cat there. So, I'm just collecting patches, iron-on patches, and sticking on there, and just having fun with it. Um, I also got in the mail this neat little, you can't really see what it is. It's a keychain, but it's got like a skinny yarn and the little heart with a crown on it that says Crochet Queen, which I have one already, but I've got that one that I've been getting these little new trinkets like, you know, yarn earrings, whatnot, that I get out that I'm going to, to mail out to people. I just haven't done it yet. And... I also got, look how tiny this is. This will work perfect with some of my itty bitty yarns that I brought home from Mexico. So, um, I've slept most of today and then spent the rest of the day working on the latch hook. I've got it done and I probably will spend this evening working on my knitting project and once I get... Well, once I get bored with that, I'll switch to something else. Um, I do need to work on Chuck's bag to get to them, but that's not in a hurry. That's not a hurry on that one, so. Um, Thursday, my goal is to get up early. Earlier than noon, anyway. Um, I still need to go to the store and get more trash bags. Um. Get out of there, you little crackheads! Let me show you where they are. Okay. See, there is a cat in there, and there's also that's where I've been putting like my tiny little bits of yarn go in there, and so I make um, palms. I was gonna make one of those little pom pom rugs, except the cats have found the palms, and even though I keep hiding them and keep blocking that off, they manage to still get in there, and so some of the palms are just destroyed at this point or whatnot. But um which reminds me speaking of scraps of yarn, I need to work on this itty bitty tiny little um granny squares that Crochet Rocks did. That you know, they're like two inches square type thing, the little tiny ones. Um because I really do want to start, you know, using my tiny little scrap yarn on that and you know Make that a long haul project where eventually, you know, I have it, <laughs> 10,000 of them and make a blanket. 10,000 will probably get me like a twin size mattress. Who knows? <laughs> anyway, um, emotionally, I am not at, like, I had gotten down to like a negative three. And my scale goes from a positive five to a negative five. Zero is completely numb. Positive five, and this is just my scale for anybody, not just for me. Positive five, think of someone that's bipolar and a full-blown mania. That's a positive five. 
Someone that is just so depressed, they can't function, they can't get out of bed, they're almost catatonic, that's a negative five. I've been hanging out, I mean, usually, normally, I hang out at a negative two, you know, a negative, to a negative one and a negative two to a zero, with a couple spikes up to, like, a one. Um, but this past week or so, I've been hanging out at, like, a negative three. So, I am back up to the negative two to negative one, not where I want to be, I would like, I mean, the average, I think the average person hangs out at a two. So, if I can get to a one, I'd be happy. Um, but, you know, things are just different every day. Um, and my hair's a mess. Anyway, I'm going to make this one a short one because yesterday's was, was fairly long. Um, hopefully, I know I'm behind on emails. I, I read emails and messages when they come in. I just, sometimes it takes me a while to respond to them. Um, so, I'm just going to try and chill out. And I really don't think I'm going to do my live on Friday so that I can have the energy to do the live on Saturday with Drew if he wants to do it. Um, I haven't talked to him yet. But I may... I mean, I was using the lives mainly to get watch hours. And I'm up to 3.1 watch hours. So, I mean, I still need to watch hours. So, if you guys could just, like, run me in the background, I'd really appreciate it. And speaking of also, if any of you guys need watch hours, email me. Let me know, because I have a computer or a laptop that's dedicated just to running laptops, and I've got multiple Gmail accounts, which means there's multiple YouTube accounts, which means I can run you on, you know, several different accounts. Um, but I just, I need to know. And um, I'm up to, I think it was at like 850 subscribers, so I'm getting there, so I'd really appreciate it if you guys could share me out. Um, I know that the last couple weeks, this has been kind of an eh, blog but you know life isn't always all happy and giggly and getting things done sometimes you know life is ugly and I'd rather show you guys the ugly part because I know that there's somebody out there that looks at that sees this and like okay I'm not the only one you know um life's a struggle for a lot of us and this YouTube community has been incredibly supportive and crocheting and knitting and doing latch hook rugs and loom knitting and whatnot has been supportive. It, it helps with the anxiety. It helps with the depression. Um, I can tell you that my mood, just when I realized how close I was, you know, to finishing the latch hook rug and actually having something completed, that helped my mood quite a bit, you know. Um, but, yeah, so, I mean, I'm going to show the ugly just because I want other people to see that they're not alone. And then I know that I'm not always going to stay in the same, you know, hole. So I want other people to see, okay, he's been in that hole and he's made it out. And if there's not some magic thing that does it, it's just putting one foot in front of the other. And sometimes, sometimes it's not a matter of putting one foot in front of the other. Sometimes it's a matter of just trying to hold still. But, you know, I know I'm not the only one out there that struggles with this. So, you know, if me sitting there and showing how pathetic I get at times helps someone else to realize, you know, you're not the only one, then great. This is, I like, you know, and I get emails and messages from you guys that say, you know, they talk about how it helps seeing, you know, my story, seeing, you know, where I am and whatnot, or the things that I'm doing, helps you guys, I mean, hearing that helps me a lot, because I'm, for someone who has a YouTube channel, I really don't like being in the spotlight, um, but it, it is different when it's through a video camera, so, I don't know, anyway, I got stuck rambling, and ended up going on several minutes past when I said I was going to go. So anyway, you guys have a good evening, and I will check in with tomorrow, and hopefully I'll have some progress to show you on my sweater. Have a great day.